Good evening to you. Thank you for watching NBC 26. I'm John Erickson. A major announcement out of Kimberly Clark in Nina. More than 250 local jobs are heading to Chicago. NBC 26's Nina Sperano was the first to report the news this morning, and she's been reporting out the developments all day long. Nina's live now with the latest update tonight. Nina? John, our state has worked so hard to keep Kimberly Clark jobs here in the state of Wisconsin. This news was hard to hear, especially this year. We do know hundreds of jobs will be moving to Chicago from Nina. We also know thousands of jobs will be staying right here. So why the change? Let's break it down. Here's what we know that 250 jobs in sales, marketing, executive management and other commercial functions are moving to Chicago in the first quarter of 2022. That's according to Casey officials. 2,500 are staying here in Wisconsin. Basically, leadership roles will be moving to Illinois. This comes over two years since Kimberly Clark and the Wisconsin Economic Development Corporation penned a five-year, $28 million tax incentive to keep 388 technical manufacturing jobs in Wisconsin. Today, the WEDC released this statement, quote, it is disappointing that Kimberly Clark has chosen to move these jobs out of our Wisconsin, especially as our state is just beginning to recover from the impact of the COVID-19 pandemic. WEDC is reviewing its contract with Kimberly Clark to determine how this decision affects the company's eligibility for job retention tax incentives, end quote. Today, we also spoke with Anthony Snyder with Fox Valley Workforce Development Board, who says despite some disappointment, he is optimistic. We make decisions about where we live, not just for jobs anymore. We make decisions based on a quality of life, where the best place is for our kids, for our lifestyle, for an economy that allows us to do things that you maybe can't do in Chicago. And so, you know, I wish Kimberly Clark well, and I wish all those 250 people well on whatever choice they make. Undoubtedly, some will remain here, and we really want to help those individuals remain here if that's what they choose to do. And another bombshell announcement today. Kimberly Clark Group President Kim Underhill is parting ways with the Kimberly Clark Corporation after 33 years with them. She's been there since 1988. Russ Torres, who is president of Kimberly Clark Professional, will take her place and will be based in Chicago. Live in Nina, Nina Sperano, NBC 26.